Hi, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share messages that I get from Spirit for all of us who are on a twin flame, soul to soul journey to reunite in this lifetime. And um, I do channeled letters for people and also do healings and readings. And um, one thing that I've just received over the last uh, two days is a number of people asking about time and when uh, when will we come into our reunion and so um, I was led to do this message so um, with the time thing there is no time in um, spirit and again I can only speak from my experience but um, the longer that I go along this journey the more I find peace in forgetting about time. <laughs> um, and that is, you know, all part of letting go and having faith and trusting in the process. And um, unfortunately, how that, you know, that when I used to listen and hear people say that, it used to make me really frustrated because I would think, well, how can you, you, you know, how can you do that? Because of course your twin is always on your mind all the time. And it's not that uh, they're not on your mind, it's just that it's about relaxing and, and about believing in the, in the bigger picture and having faith in the, the journey of the soul and having faith in uh, the ascension of the planet and having faith in, uh, yeah, b the bigger picture. Um, and I think um, when there is no, when there is no time frame, because it's just a knowing within, um, it kind of, you just kind of, it takes the pressure off, right? Because we can't know when, <laughs> um, just like, you know, we can't know all the details of our lives because that wouldn't help us grow, it wouldn't help us evolve because what would we, what would be the point if we knew everything? So around the timing question, I never ever can do, well, I never give out timing because timing is not a possible, is a not a thing. Um, and I know that, um, I think there's been a, a lot, there's always a lot of hype around specific dates being significant and, um, and all of that. But again, it's not something that I really buy into because I go by the energy. I go by the messages that we get. I go by the signs from spirit. I go from the feeling within and um and we see that all around us right and and ultimately you have the answer <laughs> and so you have your truth within you and so uh, around timing it's it's a written in your heart and it's about trusting in your journey and knowing that every single day that goes past, you're getting closer and closer into your reunion. Um, and every day it's a journey into more and more of uncovering who you are, uncovering your light, uncovering your light together as souls. And the only thing that I can say is that um, as time has gone past, because of course we, we do actually measure stuff by time in this physical reality, um, it has got so much easier. That is one thing I can definitely say. So if you are thinking, oh my God, I cannot possibly go through another however long, um, I can say that it gets, I mean, obviously you're still working through the energies because we're taking a collective part of the pie and that's all about the ascension of the planet. So of course, we all go through those ascension, uh, that's just part of it, but um, the more that you move into the space of just knowing, the more that you trust that you will just come together when the time is right, because it's your soul path, it's your destiny, it is your destined path, then the more it allows you to relax, the more it allows you to enjoy, the more it allows you to not you know to really enjoy all the signs and the mystic beauty of the journey and
and that's what I think gets very, very, um, it gets overlooked because there's so much, of course, there is a lot of pain and, you know, abandonment and all, and separation and all of those things that, of course, are part of the journey. But uh, uncovering the beauty of the journey is, as you progress, it, it becomes much easier to focus on that rather than, you know, the, the pain of it, which, you know, I definitely had right at the beginning. I mean, definitely, that was, it was super hard. But, um, yeah, so the question, so it's just because I've had, yeah, it always happens that it's like four or five people all at the same time, all saying, when am I coming into my union? And I really don't believe that anyone can give you a time because there is no time, there is a knowing. And the more powerful you get in your own truth and standing in your own truth, the more that you will get to, um, you're coming closer and closer and closer. We're all coming closer as we lift up the planet, right? So this is why it's amazing because ultimately we're all energy. And we're here to play this incredible energetic game. And that's the beauty of the journey. So with that, I'm just gonna end on a whisper. I bought this oracle yesterday. And um, I, I'm just gonna pick a card because um, I'm just gonna say, what message do you want to give us today? And so the message from our twins is this. Oh, look, you couldn't have been more perfect because you are limitless. Recognize this truth and you can do anything you choose to do. And look at that. It has the two swans. <laughs> now, this is quite, again, um, the two swans, swans are the, another, you know, sign, they, the swans they make for life. And so um, it is, you know, we are all limitless beings. We all have, en you know, limitless possibilities of what we can achieve and how we can work with our energy to create amazing things. And look, it's also number four, which is about grounding this strong foundation into the physical. So um, every day, you know, live your life with intent and it will just unfold before you in the perfect divine timing for you. So the answer to when will I come into my union is in the perfect divine timing for you to blossom in your soul truth. So at times we are too close to a situation and can only see things from one perspective. There is a multitude of possible outcomes to this situation. Take a broader outlook, release the need to control what is happening and allow your inner knowing to assist you. Things always work out as they should. There you go. So that is the message. Things are always working out as they should. Things will all happen in the perfect time for you. All right, well, I hope that helps. And remember, you are limitless. All right, take care. Bye.